This is an R tutorial. Got two minutes? Learn some statistical programming in R. It's easy, free, and fun. This tutorial how to change and recode variables and values in a data frame in R. I'm going to present three examples in increasing order of difficulty, but also increasing order of flexibility. Let's load an example data frame into R. Here's what empty cars data looks like. Let's run the fix parentheses empty cars close parentheses function on empty cars. Now I can just point and click, and if you like SPSS, this fix function is great. Look, I can change the row name to the Hornet and make it the busy B. Excellent. Now when I close this, all of the changes have been made in the empty cars data table. The problem with the fix function is that there's no record of the changes. So this and this, the fact that those two changes have, made, have been made, there's no record of it anywhere. That's the problem with that one. Technique number two, the transform function. Transform generally requires a data frame as an input, a new column to make, and then an equation to calculate that column. Here it comes. Empty cars now has a kilometers per liter column. See that? Calculated off of the mile per gallon. You can actually put more than one equation. Like this transform function, I've got a kilometers per liter and a wattage column calculated. And look, empty cars now has two new columns in it. Technique number three, the bare bones approach. These two commands do the exact same thing as the transform function did up here, calculating a miles per gallon times 0.2 Four, uh, 425 equals the kilometers per liter column and the wattage equals horsepower times 746. But let's say I only want to do it on a subset of records. Let's read in a fresh empty cars data frame. Now create a logical vector AM wherever AM equals 1, which is not all of the records. Paste that into the records parameter here and here, the rows parameter of the empty cars function. And now the empty cars data frame will only have been updated with a wattage wherever AM equals 1. Everywhere else, it's still missing. Giddy up. This has been a work of R.